a large part of the nation is facing heat advisories for today and tomorrow. This peak feels like temperatures here for the next few days still in the triple digits. So Way 31's Alexis Scott joins us now to let us know what you should be thinking about with your pets in heat like this. Well, okay, it's obviously not hot here where I am anymore. I'm in downtown Huntsville, Big Spring Park. But if you have your pets outside tomorrow, when we do have another heat advisory. The big note here is that they will need lots of water and shade just like we do. Inside the kennels, many of the dogs were happy to be inside, but they still got time outside. Karen Buchan works with the Huntsville Animal Services, and she told me around this time, many people want to bring their dogs with them while they're out, but it's actually not safe. You need to avoid letting them walk on hot pavement or sidewalks, and dogs also need cool air and water just as much as we do. A dog's normal temperature is 101 to 102. So if they're panting in hot air, they're not cooling off. So it's Buchanan told me if you notice your dog is panting a lot, you need to hose them down with water and get them water to drink and then get them out of the heat immediately. Now, I don't know if you can see me. It's raining pretty hard where I am right now, but with it being so hot earlier today, she told me if you can walk your pets earlier in the morning or later in the evening, then the better for you and your dog. Reporting live in Huntsville, Alexa Scott with One News.